Mönchengladbach fondly remember their glory days of the 70s. But now it's time for new heroes, like Patrick Hamann. Once touted as the new Marco Reus, he's even put the hurt on Bayern Munich in the past. But lately, he spent more time on the bench. Hamann has been with Gladbach for six years, but starting this season, he's been facing some internal competition from Andre Hahn, who also plays Hamann's position. You yourself say you're very ambitious. Is your career moving fast enough for you? Absolutely not. As an athlete, you have to be ambitious to achieve your goals. Of course, it's hard to reach them right away. You have to be patient, though that's tough sometimes. In the 10th round, you scored two goals and got an assist against Hoffenheim. But the season didn't start out so well for you. You didn't play at all at the start, and then just a little. <laughs> but now things are going great again. Is that typical for you? It's not typical, but it does reflect the life of a footballer. There are times when things don't go so well and you just have to get through it. When the season began, I didn't play at all. Then I got sent on more and more. I played an entire half against Schalke. In those minutes on the pitch, you could see I gave it my all. If you haven't got to play for a while, does that make you even more ambitious? It seems that way. Yes, you're really incensed. You want to play no matter what, so when you're held back, it's very sobering and tough to take. At first, I hardly played at all. But I must say, Andre Hahn played right wing and did a great job. He scored great goals and set up great plays. And you just have to accept that. But if you keep at it and give it your all, you'll prevail. I imagine that's really hard. Someone new joins the team, takes over your position and plays well. That must really get to you. It does. It's tough to explain. Last season I played in every match, yet when the Bundesliga kicked off again, I found myself sitting for 90 minutes on the bench time and again. Now the papers are raving about both of you together, about Hahn and Hermann. In photos you're seen hugging one another. So is that gratifying too? Hugely gratifying. Two competitors who shared a spot at the start of the season are now playing together and doing it well. We complement one another and can swap places. He goes left and I go right. And that pays off, as you saw during the game against Hoffenheim. So even for professionals, the trick is work hard and be patient. The principle is the same. You can't change it. At home, you're a bit down and keep asking why you're not playing or thinking you have to play. But it's all for naught. As soon as you're on the pitch or the training field, you just have to give 110 percent and show you want to play. But what do you do when you're depressed at home? It's tough. I take the dog for a walk or watch TV or go to the movies, but it's almost impossible to switch off entirely. But you seem like someone who's never in a bad mood. No, at home you really can't stop thinking about things, that you might have been able to get the ball another way or stuff like that, but it doesn't help. Do you still brood? Yes, I also have sleepless nights, especially after a match that didn't go so well. As you're ambitious, could you imagine leaving your club to take the next step up the career ladder? I could, but it's tough to say. I like my team and want to play here as long as I can. But in soccer, things can change so fast that it's hard to know what will happen in a few years' time. So I can't say yet. Then I wish you fewer sleepless nights. Thank you.